Good morning. It's 8 30. I don't really have many plans today. I do have plan is I have an interview at three o'clock. Um, I actually already accepted a job offer. I mean, that's why I came up here. But I mean, you just never know. <laughs> so I applied for this other government job and I got a call back the other day for an interview. And I was like, sure, I'll interview, see what they're talking about. This one is on like an Air Force base and stuff. So I'm going to have to see if the pros outweigh the cons and stuff like that. You know, you got to keep your options open. You never know. But we'll just see. I just want to hear what they have to say and what type of salary they're offering. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. I think I'll probably go um, fix me something to eat because I have not really been eating breakfast at all. Um, so I'll go fix me something to eat and then I'll go to the gym and I want to take a bubble bath. So I'll take a bubble bath and then I'll just chill out. Yeah. So for Christmas, I asked my boyfriend for a violin. <laughs> I don't even know what else to do. The plan is not to spend more money today. That's the plan, okay? Y'all think I can do it? <laughs> is this a challenge? How many y'all think I can do it? I think I can do it. <laughs> today i have like you know just gotten ready you know wash my face brush my teeth wash up and all that kind of stuff i put my contacts in today and i did cook breakfast and then i cleaned up a little bit i washed the dishes dried them put them away and then i kind of swept the floor and now i'm working on my um reasonable accommodation stuff for my dog um, Batman, getting all his records and the housing letter and everything I need to do to, um, get my dog here with me. Uh, so weird being in this new place alone, but soon baby boy, bad boy, baby bat will be with me and I'll feel a lot better. <laughs> I will feel a lot better with Batman here with me. And I'm thinking about some cool ideas that I can do for the balcony. I definitely do want to, um, like, close it in. Like, I want to put, like, some type of sheer or something else so that he doesn't, like, fall off the balcony. Because I definitely want that to be, like, his little outside pee, -pee area. And I was going to get a little cute fire hydrant for out there. Oh, Oh, I was thinking like, what if he drips down into the other people's balcony? But it's not set up like that. <laughs> so I'm getting his stuff together. And the last thing I have to do is submit a picture of him. And yeah, just got to submit a picture of my baby doll. Hey, I finally got ready to go to the gym. Yes, so I guess I'll go do something productive for my hair. I just kind of rolled it all over. Y'all can see it's just, it's just roll back, roll back. And then I have a, 
on those giant clips on the back. So this they don't need. I need some water. Okay guys, so I um I came back up, so I did go to the gym. I did some I did some cycling, I did some rowing, I did some workouts in the exercise ball, just some ab stuff, and then I did a little dance routine um, in front of the little bar, the little mirror bar, where they have like the, the hard floor. I did that. It just made me, I mean, of course I could have done the dance in my room, but I don't know, it felt like a little dance studio. Like when I really used to go to Zumba, it felt like the Zumba room. So I did the little dance right there. Um, so I got about a good 60 minutes of exercise in. Then I just came back up, um, ran me a bath. I just put on some clothes. I was just gonna redo the style that I had, but once I took it down and sprayed my hair with the rose water and put a little oil in it, I was like, I kind of like it. So I left it down and now I'm trying to get into this lock and key stuff again. I finally found out more of what happened because I, I probably stopped 10 minutes into it yesterday. So I'm worried. I'm going to finish this episode. And then again, I told you guys I have an interview at three. So I'll be doing that. That's not why I have this shirt on because it's a phone interview. But I don't know. I feel like. I just felt like putting on a nicer shirt for the phone interview. <laughs> I don't know, child, don't ask me, but. Just ate a banana and two pieces of cheese and drunk some juice, pretty much. Folks, I had the interview and I guess I'll go make dinner. I think we're gonna do the menu that I talked about, the pork chop, the green bean, and the baked potato. <clears throat> so let's let's go do it. Let's go do it. And y'all should be proud. I haven't gone outside. I did none today. I killed my black self in the house. <laughs> Pork chop. I just wash these dishes. I just washed it. How long is this gonna take? Ugh. That y'all think I should cook the big potato, the medium potato, or the little potato? Which potato? Mm, we're gonna do the medium. No, we're gonna do the little. We're gonna do the little potato. <laughs> I will go, y'all. Bad because y'all remember my little knife set? I thought it was gonna be twelve knives. That's like a little excessive. But it's actually six knives. It just comes with the with the blade covers. That's so lame. <clears throat> I got all these knives. I'll probably use this one. Hey guys, these are all my leftovers. There's like five little pork chops, green beans. So here's my little plate. I'm just gonna eat and continue watching my little show. Looks good. I need to get a tripod. Like I can't believe I didn't bring one with me. How dare I not bring a tripod? This is so unlike me. But, um, so since I have an appointment at the CVS Minute Clinic. Um, I should schedule a booster shot too. <clears throat> but I'll do it after after I go on, after I go to New York. So yeah, I'm trying to see. I know CVS got some mugs in there, and I can get a lighter out of there. And yada yada to light these candles up. Let me get ready to go. I'm tired. Okay guys, the high is like 40 something today. So this is what I'm wearing. Um, Yeah. So it is what it is. 
do I look warm? I don't do cold very well. So I hope I have enough on. Oh, I don't look crazy. Anyway. Put the lights off. Cut that one off. To get that big one over here. Yeah. 37 degrees outside. 37 degrees. I'm actually gonna take the bus today. A little nervous it's a little different than the metro and i wish i left earlier i wish i left earlier child you guys i'm on the bus and my card wouldn't scan or something so i asked the people like when do you pay when do you pay you know and it was like because of the pandemic you ain't gotta pay there was like you don't gotta pay the bus you don't gotta pay the train and i was like that can't be right because <laughs> that cannot be right but the, huh, them people was like you just squeeze between between the um train which macaws and they're not gonna stop you and i was like huh that can't be right <laughs> that cannot be right <laughs> um do Google Maps got me walking through the hood because why well, I just seen a visual, you know, where like somebody died and I do a little memorial. Um, <laughs> let me go. I'm glad it's morning time. I've decided to take the bus to ride, take a bus and a train to Pentagon City, which is a mall in Virginia. I should get there about one o'clock. It's about 12.30 right now. We made it to the train, y'all. Phew. We gotta go. Gonna go and see. things I bought from the mall but right now I do want to unbox what I got in packaging okay so I think this box this first box I'm more than sure that it's for my job yeah they're supposed to be sitting like monitors and stuff here in the next couple of weeks
the dough box. Is this my laptop? This is just a, oh, this must be the monitor they were talking about. I've never seen a monitor like this before. So this is the monitor. This come with the carrying case and got it, got it, got it. So the next box should come soon and it should be, um, I guess my computer and everything else because I will be working from home for a while. And then I'll go in the office as needed or on site as needed. So that'd be cool about that today. So this is thing my best friend got me. She um, she bought this for my Amazon wish list. And if you guys want to buy something too, you can. No, no pressure. <laughs> um, but she got me the card. You guys kept saying, Tony, you need a card, you need a card. My best friend had already bought one. But it just took some time before it got delivered. So it's just the utility cart. Um, let's see what my bestie said. She said, congrats T, be still and see what God is trying to show and teach you during this time. Know that God has a purpose for this journey. I pray you continue to walk in your purpose with no more procrastination or worries from Ori. Thank you friend, you, she know I be procrastinating. That's why I need to get to studying. I'm gonna study for real tomorrow. <laughs> I'm just so tired right now. I'm glad I got leftovers to eat. While I was out, I did not um, buy nothing to eat. I actually, um, what I do? I bought a drink from CPS and some dishwashing pads or something. Yeah, that's in my, that's in my booby. And I had got some candy, but I used my $10 care pad, so I didn't really, um, I didn't really, you know what I'm trying to say. I didn't really, I only spent 40 cents, okay? I do want y'all to know that I just bought like a bunch of sweaters and stuff and just because I just really felt like I had nothing to wear this morning. Like, <laughs> I didn't, I just really felt like I didn't have anything to wear. <laughs> like, not jacket wise, but just like tops. I just wanted to put on a sweater and I don't really have that many. And I think I left one of my sweaters I had wore it to work and then um, my aunt put it in the washroom and I don't know if it ever got washed with the re rest of everything. Still did not get a lighter. What a girl gotta do to get a lighter? <laughs> but um, so yes, I have no lighters. But yeah. But guys, as you can see, I've been doing a superb job about keeping the kitchen clean and putting the pots and pans away like girl i really be cleaning the kitchen every day every time i freaking cook i'm like hey like it's just that glass in there now i'm about to go change my clothes like i don't know that's my favorite thing ever to like come home and just put on lounge clothes that's my favorite thing ever dinner i'm just having juice and some leftovers i didn't want to do another potato so just green beans and pork chops <laughs>
this bidet like a month ago and it's been here at the apartment well maybe not a month ago maybe like three weeks ago but i'm just like do i really feel like putting this together tonight so i got it on amazon no special tools no batteries how do y'all feel about bidets <laughs> do i want to put this together tonight do y'all want to see this in the vlog? Okay, let's see. Without flexible pipe, unscrew the pipe connector. It's still water in there. I'm installing the bidet, but. to do <laughs> what if I use the top I need something to hold the water that might fall out my toilet without the flexible pipe with flexible pipe take off the water supply pipe and then place the flexible pipe in. That pushed it. The bidet is installed. Didn't take too long. I had to watch a video. So I'm gonna check the back for leaks um, today, the rest of the night, and tomorrow. But it does work. It does work. It's my toilet. I just sprayed myself, but. If you turn it on a little bit, you see it drips down. And then if you want more water pressure, it goes up. And then you can adjust the nozzle. And I can see the little adjuster. It kind of wiggles. So yeah. I'll let y'all know if it's a good investment or not. I think I pay like 24 bucks. <laughs>